Hi everyone, I am Deepti. I am a research fellow at the Indian Institute of Astrophysics in Bangalore. I joined IIA in uh, 2018 and since then I have been working towards my PhD. Uh, I originally belonged to uh, Kerala, Trishur district and I have completed my bachelor's in applied physics from the KKTM government college affiliated to the University of Calicut and my master's in physics from Cochin University of Science and Technology in Kochi. So like everyone, I have been fascinated by the night sky and uh, since childhood, I have been uh, looking at the constellations and everything and fascinated by them. This is one reason for me to take up astrophysics and astronomy. Uh, also one fundamental question that I have always thought about is how the universe came about and how it is as we see today. So that also motivated me towards pursuing astrophysics. And I got my first experience of actual research in astronomy and astrophysics as a summer research fellow of the Indian Academy of Sciences, where I worked at physical research laboratory in Ahmedabad under the supervision of Professor Shashikiran Ganesh. And I got to visit the observatory run by PRL, which is situated at Mount Abu. And this is the Mount Abu infrared observatory, wherein I could uh, also observe with the uh, PhD students there and uh, look at the beautiful images of uh, globular clusters produced using the 1.2 meter telescope at Mount Abu Observatory. And uh, all these factors were a uh, reason for me to choose a career in astrophysics. So after joining IIA, I attended one year of coursework and since then uh, I have been working on my research problem under the supervision of Professor Annapurni Subramaniam. Uh, the IIA being one of the premier research institutes in India has a great conducive environment ca for carrying out research. I enjoyed my time here uh, with the academic discussions with the eminent faculty members as well as students. I could attend a colloquium as well as seminars by various speakers and the group meetings were very helpful uh, in an academic sense. Outside of academia also, uh, IIA has been a great institute. So we had a great time at uh, Bhaskara, our hostel. Uh, we used to have a lot of extracurricular activities such as games and sports, as well as celebrate uh, various festivals together. Um, we also carried out outreach activities as part of uh, the SCOPE uh, initiative at IIA. And we had a lot of fun uh, as a group in IIA as well as in the hostel. So for my PhD, I worked on uh, some of the oldest objects in the universe, which are uh, globular clusters. There are about 150 globular clusters in our galaxy, such as the one shown here, which is Omega Centauri. So what is a globular cluster? A globular cluster is a collection of up to a million gravitationally bound stars, which are located almost at the same distance from us. So these stars, since there are, there are up to a million stars, they help us study how a star evolves through its lifetime. So studying globular clusters also helps us to understand how the galaxy has evolved chemically as well as dynamically. So in my PhD thesis titled Multi-Wavelength Study of Hot Stars in Galactic Globular Clusters, I have mainly focused on stars which are hotter than 8000 Kelvin and found in the globular clusters within our galaxy. So for studying these stars which emit copious amounts of ultraviolet radiation, I have used data sets from the ultraviolet imaging telescope on board the Astrosat Observatory which is India's first multi-wavelength space mission. I have also used complementary data sets which are uh, available in literature based on the observations from Hubble Space Telescopes as well as the Gaia mission. So uh, recently I defended my PhD thesis successfully and now I will be moving on for my uh, future goals. So I have been offered a postdoctoral position at Steward Observatory in the University of Arizona in United States uh, where I will be working with Professor David Sand on uh, dwarf galaxies and the properties of stellar populations within them. So this is a great extension to what I have done in my PhD and I am excited for this uh, new journey. So based on my research experience and life at IIA, I would just like to suggest a few things to my junior colleagues. Uh, this would be just to uh, use this golden opportunity to uh, 
develop as many skill sets as possible during your time and this will not only help you in academia but this will also take you forward in your life. Uh, I would also like to uh, suggest you to use this opportunity to uh, make as many connections as possible, attend many conferences, workshops, schools, etc., talk to people and also learn about the research field which is outside your area of interest. This will definitely help you uh, be a better uh, academician. Uh, basically, although you are doing astrophysics and cosmology, basically you are a physicist uh, by training. So you should definitely be interested in other fields as well. And uh, one more thing uh, I would like to say is that although PhD is a definitely a stressful time, you should find ways to manage it. Uh, you can uh, in, indulge in various hobbies and stuff and definitely try to enjoy your time and this is a time which will never come back in your life and it's a very nice time. So uh, that's all from my side.